Hi guys, Mr. Off Waffles here. The day is finally upon us. Cyberpunk 2077 is out now. We're running it on max settings, absolutely cranked to the limits of ultra everything. Thanks to my sponsors, NVIDIA and Scan Computers. I've got a link below if you want to build a system like my one. I'm going to be jumping in with a playthrough here, but I want to hear your feedback also throughout this video. If there's anything you want changed, camera placement, the way that I'm talking and doing my commentary, the way that I'm interacting with the world, anything at all. If you've got feedback, I would love to hear it in the comments down below because I want to make this the best series I can for you guys. So just hit me with any feedback, comments, critique, etc. that you've got. We're going to be clicking new game here. We're going to be going normal difficulty. I think that's the way to go here. It's, uh, it's probably the sort of standard thing that the developers intended. And we've got to pick life path. Now, to give you a little context, I did just do the start of a recording and my audio messed up. So I started again because I wanted it to be 100% perfect for you guys. So I've seen the very, very beginning of the game. Uh, but I'm feeling Street Kid personally for my kind of vibes. Uh, Nomad starts outside the city. I think it's a bit of a more vehicles based approach. But personally, I think Street Kid is going to be my... Uh, it's just sort of my DNA. That's what I'm... Uh, what I'm feeling. We're going to go female body type. And we're going to go... I'm V. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> I'm V. I'm V. I think we're going to go with a feminine voice there. Um, let's just hit randomize a couple times just to show you guys. Look at the breadth of the creator. Like, look how insane these characters can be. It's so nutty. It looks so cool. I Honestly, like... I, I, I just love all of them. I, I, I'm, I'm simping so hard, dude. I am simping so hard. I think they just all look so unbelievably... Like, look at her eyes. What, like, incredible stuff. Truly incredible stuff. Um, we're going to go with... We're just going to hit randomize a couple times, but I, I've, got a, I've got a vision in mind for the sort of character I want to build. And there she is. And there she is. Dude, I love the fro. It is so cool. We're going to go... We're going to go real pasty pale because i mean i've got to be true to i've got to be true to myself honestly um what's the best yeah we're gonna go nice and pasty i mean i can't i can't hide from my <laughs> from my reality uh skin type i think i want to go for basically like a, a pretty clean one um but a little bit a little bit of sort of contour on there doesn't hurt uh hairstyle yes this is the hairstyle that i want to go for for now i'm sure we can change it and yes, before any of you ask and you think that I'm insane, we are indeed going for the massive green fro. We're just doing it, okay? It's like I'm living my best life. I'm a bit of a sort of like sarky kind of uh, know-it-all street kid here. Oh my god, that's terrifying. I didn't know you could actually do that with the eye color. I didn't really explore this that much last time. Evidently, heart eyes, cat eyes. Okay, okay. Let's let's click this because we can actually see all of the options here. So I I think that like I think that that contrast looks really cool, but also maybe that's just too corny. The cat eyes does look. Oh, that looks so sick. And the like hypno bro, I'm hypno toad, legitimately hypno toad right now. Do we go with just like a normal kind of eye color? Oh, there's like oh I see. That's the difference. Is I've got loads of like bloodshot eyes. Let's just go with let's go with a clean eye look. And I mean, do we go for something where it's just like blacked out? Bro, that's kind of spooky. I'm not going to lie. I, I'm going to... I think I'm going to go with, with just the regular eye color. And we're going to go with like... Uh, ooh, those blue eyes. Mm, okay. It's blue or red for me, dude. I think we're, red would be the zany option. Blue would be the like more normal one. We're going to go with blue in this case. Because the rest of me is going to be a little bit zany. Um, so, eyes wise... I actually really like her eyes right now. Like, I actually really like her whole face. Like, her jaw looks pretty good as well currently. Um, we can we can mess with a couple of these just to see if there's like... Oh, actually, I like that. I like when it's like... Yeah, I think that's the one that I want to go for. When it's just a little bit sort of like almost like sleepy-eyed kind of thing, if that's, if that's a thing. Uh, in terms of eyebrows, personally, I think that the bushier eyebrows would be good. And if we go color-wise... I think, like, darker brows would be good on her. Uh, I could just go for green, but I feel like the contrast would be better if it was, like, a darker color. Um, definitely not feeling... Although, it depends. It depends what we make her lips. I actually really like her lips right now. Um, and I, like, honestly, this is, this is pretty close to the character that I want. Because I have spent a little time in the creator already. Um, 
if we just mess around with the nose a little bit, I do like the idea of having a smaller, like, or nose on the smaller side. That's a little bigger and longer. That's quite a nice nose, I think. I think that's quite a good one. Um, it's a little narrow, though. Maybe we, maybe we go for something like that. I think that's that's probably a good a good middle ground. I quite like that. And then mouth. I want to see if I can give her, I think, like, quite a small mouth. Like, that's quite a big top lip. Let's not go for too big a top lip there. Um, I think something, but with, like, a little bit of a, little bit of a sort of, uh, let's see. Mm, slightly, slightly different to that, I think. Mm, yeah. Probably something like that. How, how do you feel about that? I think that that's probably the way to go. I'm feeling 12. Now, jaw. I quite like her jaw. 12 for jaw, I'm quite liking. I uh, don't want a massive jaw, that's for sure. Um, that's quite square. I, I'm, I quite like the idea of it being quite a slender jaw. That's a little bit sort of rounded. Um, so I like I like 21 as well, actually. Um, so if it's between 12 and 21, it's a little bit more long, I think. I think I'm probably going to go with 12. I think 12 was a good look there. And then is can't even see them. So we'll find out in the game what they look like. Cyberware. Out of the options here, I really like the ones that are a little bit more minimal. Um, I do like that one on the neck. But I think what I want to go with is, uh, is that. I think that's what I want. Facial scars. Now this. This is an interesting one. I want this. That like patterning. I think that looks so cool. Um, so we're going to go with that because it's 2077, baby. We can do whatever we want. Uh, piercings. Um, I think we're going to go with a, uh, septum and I don't know if I want, do I just want the septum and, um, you know what? We're, oh no, that's too much. That's too much. Okay. We're going to go with, the, uh, actually that's an eye ring as well. I've just noticed. Can I just get the septum on its own? Oh wait, is the eye ring? It's not an eye ring. That's part of my implant. Okay, I didn't even realize. My bad. So, I can get like eyebrow studs. Honestly, maybe we go with that. Maybe we go with that. I think that that looks good. And then for piercing color, black. Yes. Okay. Feeling the vibes. Teeth, not red. Not red. Absolutely not red. So, the options here, we could go for like normal teeth or we could go for like a silvery type like grill. And I don't think gold looks so good, to be honest. I definitely don't like the red, don't like the bronze. Is it going to be silver or normal? I'm sort of feeling normal for now. I'm sure we can change that later. Eye makeup, I actually really like that makeup right now with the dots. Um, although it is nice there, but I don't know, man. I feel like, no. Okay, not a fan of that one. Maybe something like that. Seven is quite nice. Yeah, uh, with, yeah, I think we're gonna go with that because like with the piercings, more dots on my face is just a lot of dots. Um, lip makeup, I'm loving the, the style there. Don't like it when it's sharper. Ooh, wow, okay. Um, and the, the half tone is quite cool. But honestly, I reckon we just go for like some standard makeup like that. And then in terms of coloring... Do we go with green or do we go with a contrasting color here? Do we go with like something more? Oh my goodness me. Okay, that's interesting. I quite like it. I quite like it dark, dude. I'm not going to lie. Like I'm 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 liking that a lot. Cheek makeup. Let's see. I'm going to go with So these are basically like freckles that I can put on. What is that even doing? I can't even see what what 5 is actually doing to my character. I think what I'm going to do here is I'm going to do one, but I'm going to make the color really light so it's just yeah literally just like some light freckling on her nose i think that's pretty cute um and then for blemishes i don't think i need any blemishes don't think i need to worry about that i forgot that was gonna happen <laughs> okay yes um we're gonna zoom through this because i've got to censor it so um we're gonna go with long nails we're gonna go with nails that are uh, let's see this, I think shiny kind of color, I think looks pretty cool. Uh, although what does this look like? I'm not sure. Not such a big fan. All right, let's go for the shiny, the shiny nails. Uh, ooh, they're all so cool. Let's go for the shiny nails. Like I got dang said, 
and then we're gonna go for just like literally um let's zoom through this stuff because again it's this is youtube video i've got to censor it i'm sorry i'm sure some of you are not gonna like that but i've got to uh let's go no body scars um and then like let's just let's just get off that screen as fast as we can okay cool so in terms of attributes i think my character is going to be my v is going to be a pretty sort of sarcastic person she's gonna be a bit of a know-it-all um she's gonna like not necessarily be the smartest person in the world sort of thing so like in terms of intelligence i don't think that needs to be cranked all the way up um i think that she's basically just like a bit of a scrappy like isn't like isn't amazing at anything but has kind of found her way uh through sort of getting by in the world um that kind of that kind of vibe is what i'm going for um not someone that's like total brainiac not someone that's total beefcake um so i think we can do a little bit of body here i think that's fine um intelligence will probably crank up by one point but then we'll probably leave it at four and not go any further um let's just let's let, let's get a fairly even across the board i think i think that would be right for my character and then in terms of what these actually do so this is raw physical power adding health stamina damage uh with fists this is cyberdeck ram uh quick hack damage and quick hack duration reflexes is passive evasion from enemy attacks crit chance and damage from mantis blades this is using tech weapons and unlocking doors i reckon that i reckon that that's going to be useful i reckon i've got a bit of tech ability because realistically like if i'm not the most sort of like powerful person in the in the world i'm gonna have to have some kind of technical know-how to get by and then resilience composure and effectiveness in operating so i reckon i'm confident i reckon i'm confident and as such i reckon i'm gonna bump my cool up because if that's about my resilience and my composure like speed at which enemies detect me in stealth is uh is lower uh i've got so a little bit better with stealth a little bit better resistance and a little bit better crit damage i reckon cool is the one to bump there so overall i think i've got a fairly even profile but with a little bit of a spike in the kind of like technical know-how and uh and my resilience because i'm determined i'm a determined v and here we go they say if you want to understand the streets, you gotta live them. Gangs, fixers, dolls, small-time pushers, you are raised by them all. Down here, the law of the jungle dictates the weak serve the strong. The only law in Night City you have yet to break. Let's get it. Oh, I'm so excited. God dang it. It's gonna be so much fun. And this is something that we can skip. Okie dokie. Here we go. God, it looks so good. A little anesthesia. Thank you. There I am. Oh. <laughs> uh, let's let's knock the shot back real quick. And my nose is broken. Each. Motherfucker. Everything chill, hermana. Some bastard tried to mug me. I handled it. Oh, local guy. You really think somebody local tried to mug me, Pepe? Listen, V. I got a problem. Serious this time. Okay. Uh, spin it out. Yeah, that's my, like, sort of, like, that's my attitude coming in a little bit here. Come on, spin it. What is it now? It's, uh, Cork. I owe him. Don't pay by tomorrow, said he'd bust my legs. He don't joke about that stuff. Got cartels in his corner. You in it with Kirk? Every man, woman, and rat in Haywood knows he's a fucking shark. My bro jumped the joint, deserved a hero's welcome. I know I fuck up, V. You ever gonna get wise, Pepe? At least tell me your brother's doing all right. Uh, doing his thing, you know. So, can you help? I'll talk to Kirk. But then you're gonna owe me one. Welcome to Cyberpunk 2077! Ah! Play close attention to the tutorials. Okay, yes, can do. Cool. So good. We're in. Saving my life, v. 
No worries, buddy. I got your back. I got you. It's all good. Can we just appreciate the world right now? And honestly, confused. Well, I'm a little confused. It's just because I'm admiring how beautiful everything is. How is it possible, dude? Okay. Yeah, can we just appreciate this, man? Can we appreciate the aesthetics and the vibes? Alrighty. Dude, I just want to talk to everyone. Let's do the objective for now, though. Alright, that's Kirk. What's up, buddy? Hey, Kirk. Want to talk? V. Been a while? Spin it. What you need? Uh, you okay there? <laughs> Holding your bagel, dude? Pepe asked me to talk you up. What, he too shot a hand over the Yetis himself? Uh, tell him I don't bite. Not yet. Okay, first up, Big Joe, what's your deal, dude? Hell's your problem. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna go straight cut to the chase. Cut him some slack, will ya? He'll pay. Just needs some more time. Do I look like a priest that runs a charity to you? You borrow Eddie's, you gotta pay him back. With interest. It's common fucking knowledge. You suggesting I let a flaky cunt who can't keep a deal off the hook? No. You let him off because it's me asking. Huh. You know me. I'm a man of the bids. So I need to know what I get out of it. Hmm. I'm not gonna threaten him. I don't think I'm that kind of person. I don't think I would just try and brute force my way through it in, a rush in that kind of... Okay, sorry, Kirk, sorry. Transactions go two ways, I get that. I'll owe you a favor. Got a Nova idea already. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cream ride there on the page. Only four of them in NC as of now. One, Rayfield Regional Director. Two, Mayor Ryan. Three, a rental service. Uh huh. And four? Number four will belong to my client. Just as soon as you clap it for me, that is. Huh. Okay. I'm not gonna be the one to say I don't think I can pull it off. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna clarify what's going on. I do this, and Pepe's debt is squared. Of course. I'm a man of my word. You know that. Whole thing simple. You swipe the Rayfield for me, I clear Pepe's account. Even toss in a cut for you, I'm such a nice guy. My man Rick works a parking structure by Embers, club where a Rayfield driver likes to kick it. There every Friday night, like clockwork. As soon as you appear, security cam shut down, gate swings up, the road is yours. You just gotta grab the Rayfield and roll out. Simple. Okay, that sounds good. And your man Rick? And your man Rick? Trust him like my own brother. Okay, that sounds good. How am I supposed to do this? Expect me to slide under the chassis on a skateboard for a quick hot wire? Fast and easy? Kirk, wheels like this got security systems. Good ones. This bitty bop works like the key Rayfield Techs use for repairs. Opens locks, bypasses identity authorization. Hmm. A skeleton key for all Rayfields in the city. Oh, come on, Kirk. Even you don't buy that. Kabuki's tech wizards sell more magical shit than this under the counter. Have a little faith. So, we all agreed then. Okay. Yeah. We are. Glad to hear it. Always said you were a bright bulb. Head to Ember's in the Glen. Rick's in the garage. Be waiting for you. You two will hit it off. Okay. Good luck out there. We'll be in touch. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> Rip. Sorry to hear that, buddy. How you doing? Okay, that's not the most uh, welcoming conversation I've ever had. <laughs> Let's head downstairs. I was at the hospital today. Javi's got some broken ribs, but 
Dude, I'm liking the fact that all these conversations are just like... They're just interesting to me, man. Can I play this? Kishu Panzer. I just want to look at everything. Fat ass motherfucker. Rude. Why do I see no goddamn lemons? No goddamn lines? Good question. They're in there for sure. Can I? Can I steal your? Can I? I can afford. If you knew. Can I steal your lemons, dude? Got nothing to do with it. Howdy. What's up? Got a seg. Exactly. Do I know you? We met before. Don't recognize you. I just asked for a smoke. Jesus. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'll leave you alone now. <laughs> I will leave you alone now. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> I'm confident, but I know I know when it's my time to leave. Honestly. Also, a candle in the street. This is a bougie alleyway, man. Siphon and a god comes to devour its children. Yo, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Tell him to be ready. Yes, Padre. Well, who do we have here? Howdy. We? Long time. Didn't know you were around. Yeah, I got... Got back from Atlanta a few weeks ago. Hmm. See, you got a good down-home welcome. How was it back east? Tell you later. Got something on my... How about you fill me in now? We'll give you a ride. Marcus, let's go. Now, what if I just run away and play basketball instead? Like, can we do that? <laughs> nope, you want me in the car. Okay. <laughs> Okie dokie. Let's do it. So where to? Where to? Glenn, drop me off at Embers. Front door? Take the ramp back of the bar. Show you where to stop. You heard it, Marcus. Dude, I'm loving the vibes right now. I'm loving this, just like. Your return to NC has been good. Busy already. Uh, I'm getting by. I'll pick up something here and there. Nothing major. But I'm getting by. Appreciate the concern. So, Atlanta didn't turn out like you expected, huh? Mm, no. As you can see, I'm back. If it had been better there, wouldn't have left. Maybe it'll all work out for the best. I guess the game's giving me a little opportunity to just look around right now. Should probably actually take it. <laughs> A gun? Stop the car. Oh. What's going on? Business. You carry? I don't think I've got a gun. Sebastian Ibarra. Looks like it's my lucky day. What do you want? To settle our biz once and for all. Got an offer for you, Patty. So listen up. Get the fuck out of Vista. Pull your boys off the street. I'll give you the Glen. Done deal. No more restless nights. See how generous I can be. Well, Patty, mm. what's it gonna be? One more fucking word. Stay out of this. I don't know you. And I don't know you. Which means you're worth shit around here and capable of even less. Well... Anything else? It seems our conversation has come to a close. Careful, Padre. Never know who's got a barrel at your six. You neither, shit bucket. Marcus, please. Wow. That was a more explosive repast than I expected from myself. But that's cool. Okay. I am pleased to see you have not forgotten you. So many of the little shits left around here. 
their spines go soft when they look down a barrel. Yeah, not me though. Who is that? No one important. He'll be gone in a week's time. Another will come in his place. He pulled iron on you. He did, and he will pay for doing so. Hmm. Godfather vibes. Pull up here. Right here. I'll just strap down below. Here, before you go. Okay. Your number? Could be useful. Maybe we can also work together again. Take ourselves back two years. Thanks, Padre. Okay. Gotta go. So go with God. Ooh. Yo, I got those Yeezy sliders on, dude. Are you good? You'll be Dan? I mean, I did just jump down into your little hole. I'm sorry, mate. Are you good? You don't look good. All right, moving on. <laughs> moving on. Can I do anything with these? I can talk to this guy. Should I talk to this guy? We're going to talk to this guy. Mind your damn business, yeah? We're not going to talk to this guy. Okay. Okay. Oh. Both of these must die. Yeah, that's, um, yep, okay. That's not great. In we go. And let's go to parking. Uh, what up, Kirk? V? Status. On location. About to find your man. Rick's one of the good guys, you'll see. I trust him like a brother. Yeah, so you said. Okay, we're going to start sprinting around. <laughs> okay, this whole place looks so cool, dude. Yeah, something I can help you with. Sure. What am I hearing? Oh, is that the TV? Okay. You, Rick? Yep. You and Kirk? Yep. Cameras are blind. You got 20 minutes. Okay, thank you. So we're finding the kind of like the Rayfield like white sort of big wheels car. Kirk, oh, hello. I see the ride. Your moment to shine, kiddo. Good luck. Let's do this. Let's take this piece of wonder tech for a whirl. You're a woman of little faith. See? We're rich. Now fire her up and call me when you're underway. I'll tell you where to go. Okay. Hmm. Looks like this will be a cool breeze. Uh, hopefully at least. Wait. Get the what fuck the out. Uh, Get the fuck out. Okay. Nope. We go in. No, we're not going. Oh, fuck. You can drive. Now out. What, what are you doing? Did you got us. Are you serious? Don't move. You're under arrest. Stay where you are. Hands where I can see him. Nice and slow. On the ground, motherfuckers. Now. Yeah, okay. All right, all right, all right. Jackie Wells, my old pal from the hood. See you haven't grown an ounce twice. Hey, Detective Stitz. Been a while, huh? Inspector Stitz. Yeah, same shit. Is he gonna kill him? Speaking of, your mug's familiar too. Come on, uh, spit it out. Yeah. I'm waiting. Yours ain't to me. Left for Atlanta, looking for a slice of happiness. Guess you didn't find it. I've always maintained it's the same for all you termites in Haywood. Born here, live here, die here. Looks like I was right. Rat got you your tongue? Fuck all about me. Truth hurts, huh? Just watch your tone. I'm not a patient man. 
Come on, Stance. Give us a break, huh? You lock us up, let just jerk off till trial. And then what? Worst case, we get some months. Hell, standing room only nowadays in El Bote. No, they'll probably be out early. Are these the thieves? Fuck ordinary yeah. street trash. Got him in custody, Mr. Fujioka. We'll be taking him now. It's a waste of effort. I have no time to testify or play it on an investigation. Suggesting we let him go, sir? I suggest you toss them in the sea. Cuff legs broken so this trash doesn't flow. Huh. You heard him. <sighs> Fuck. Wait, 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 wait. Oh no. Oh no. Motherfucker. Honestly, for a sec there, things looked iffy. I wasn't sure we'd worm out of that alive. Nah. Stents wouldn't do us like that. You sure about that? Uh huh. He's Haywood born, bred, and grown like us. Hates suits as much as you do. Did what he had to do. That's it. If I hadn't come, you'd be cruising Night City in sexy wheels right now. Well, the car didn't work, so. No, oh, come on. Job was toxic from the start. Even Kabuki under the counter magic can't get around an alarm like that. Should have known I'd have the PD on my ass. So, maybe now, as God ordained, Jackie Wells. V. I know you. You hang at the Coyote. Hmm. Got the job to steal those wheels at the Coyote. From Kirk. You work with that sewer slug? Pepe owes him big, and can't afford to pay, so I stepped up. Man, gotta wonder about Pepe letting slimy Kirk boss him around like that. Heard what they say. He's backed by cartels. Cartels? No, no, listen. I know those cartel types, and I guarantee you, none of them have even heard of Kirk. El cabrón's gotta learn. He don't do people in Haywood dirty. Come on, let's go have some lunch. Lunch, uh, dude. I'm, I'm, I'm a hungry, I'm a hungry girl. I can always go for some lunch. Lunch? <laughs> you would not believe my mama's chili. Best in town. I'm in. Getting one of my good feelings. About what? About us. It's a kind of chemistry, you know. Come on, I'm fucking starved. Okay, food it is. Let's go. I kind of like this guy. Hello there, Night City! Stanley here with you, and we got another day ahead of us in this city of dreams. Ooh, I love this town. Love it like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her. Every new day here means a hundred new arrivals. But only half these gongs will survive a year. And that's if it's a good one. And why do these peeps come to NC? Well, to be street samurai like Morgan, Blackhand, and Waylon Boa Boa. The greater the risk, the bigger the bouquet, kids. Or so they say. But you can only be a major league player for so long. The faster you live, the faster you burn out. If uh -oh. you don't get a bullet to the brain first. Oh no. This is so cool. NC's legends. Know where you'll find most of them? The graveyard. Ooh. Matters not where you're from. Matters not where you start. What matters here is the walk you walk. In Night City. The city of dreams. Okay. So now I... Oh. The chick we're looking for is somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Eyes and ears open, all right? 
Speaking of which, got you a little something. Hmm. Militech training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Uh, for some target practice in VR? You know what? I think I'm gonna skip it. Not now, Jack. No time. Maybe later. Sure, sure. Manana. 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 Let's see. Did the fixer give you any tips? Wakako give you any tips and tricks for the job? I'm not your mother. Just do what I pay you for. It's easy work. Sha. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do this. All right. Elevator. This way. Cool. Sounds good. So yeah, what I was gonna say is I guess me and Jackie have some history now, which is cool. I actually really like that. I've known this guy for a little while. Here we go. Uh, where are we going? Apartments? Or are you doing it? There we go. Oh, I got a call. Targets Sandra Dorset. Targets Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. We. Sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. Charming. <laughs> okay. Let's... Let's just... Calm the hell down, both of you. Almost there. Yeah, Bug. You focus. Still no answer to all my problems. Pain. Oh, he's got the got the irons out. Dude, Target the atmosphere. Target should be inside, but I got zero eyes on her bio mom. Fingers Hello. crossed it's not too late. Is that you? Oh, I hate this life or death shit. Hurry, try hacking the door. Think you can trip it on your own, V? Yeah, I think I can do this. What is it that exactly I need to hack? Remote activation to on that. Okay, let's do that. Beautiful. No profile. <sighs> Are we fucking late? Is that her? Is that our target, V? Oh no. Oh no. Uh, that's not good. Um, let's take the cigarettes, because why not? Sandra Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corpo immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fix ups. Not our lucky gal. Let's keep looking. God damn. Okay. down and hide the body. Nice. Could have done that better myself. Cool. Well, thanks for the uh, encouragement, Jackie. Let's take that. Well, let's try and do that. And so with this, it's BD55. So I've got to go BD55. There we go. Let's exit that interface. And let's distract enemies there. You know what? We're going loud. 
They're going loud. And the reason for that is basically that I wanted to just try out this gunplay a little bit. I was hoping that... Oh, what was that? I was hoping that my hack would pull them over there. Loads of stuff here. Nice. What is this? Max dog. Okay, wait. You dead? Sit down. Oh, hello. Okay. Is there a better... Oh, hello. There's a gun. Um, let me... Uh, I, so I can dodge to the side like this. Like, That. Oh my god! Okay, that was actually really cool. Well. Quick reload here. Don't see any movement on the sensors. Looks like you got them. You're clear to go. Oh, scab leader. Shoot, where the hell's our target? Look around. Gotta be there somewhere. Okay, I just got a gun. Let's grab that. Item components. Cool. Yeah, so I've, I've grabbed that gun. I'm not exactly sure how I equip that just yet, but I'll do that in a second. So I'm getting used to these icons. So that's pain editors and mortality rates. It's a readable thing. Okay. Cool. <laughs> I like how you can still open the door and there's this massive hole in the wall. That's great. That is bounce back. That's an injector. Okay, that's health. That's a health injector. So what these do is you hit X and there you go. You can see it gives me a 25... Or it, it, it actually bumps my whole... It bumps bumps the health regen as well. Cool. I can get a shirt. Let's take that. That'll hopefully be useful. Um, loot these things while we're at it. Got a trilby. Got a nice little bit of readable stuff. And let's use this. Oops. There we go. Okay. Messages. Ooh, we can go to the net here. Huh, let's check the messages first. Toys. From such a tech user virus, make sure we ordered a jailbreak. Militech lock on sites. Araska hormone regulator. Sorry, Arasaka. Optics actuator and cosmetic real skin. Okay, from Gomp to Arteon. And in net, the Night City network. I've got the guide to Night City. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me see if there's anything else that we can do in here. Can we, can we actually, like, I don't think we can, okay, never mind. I think that was just, just a terminal to sort of look at fresh meat. You're a dead man walking from Victor to Blaze. Okay. Interesting. Well, let's, uh, let's keep it moving, I guess. Jesus. Oh no. Okay. Oh dear. I mean, I got a stomach of steel, but <laughs> this. Oh, this. Yeah. I wasn't made for this shit, you know. I know, dude. Chop shops. What they do to people. Fucking scab psychos. Yeah. This is gonna be rough. Oh dear. I think I got her. Got our target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, jack into our biomod. Need to know what we're dealing with. This does not look good. I'm gonna mention that we've got another body real quick. She's in a tub of ice, crammed in with another. Fuck. Like slabs of meat. Keep it together, V. If she survives, she won't remember a thing. Tiny scar on the subconscious, that's all. Heard people who live through shit like this get panic attacks without ever knowing why. You'll be sipping a glass of ice cold water, and suddenly your hands shake it. V, Jack into her biomon. We need to know what we're dealing with. All right, here we go. Jacking in. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomon. Firmware we could fig or a neurovirus. Carajo, T-Bug. You ain't seeing this place. This is tubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? 
Got an idea. Check her neural cord. Find a shard. Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomod. Is that safe? Is that even safe? Can't we just get her out of here? We found her still breathing. Can't lose her. We need that biomod working. Checking for hemorrhages, whatever. Find that shard and yank it. All right. Found the shard. We're moving now. Check the biomod. Anything changed? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon Clave's trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Ay, pobrecita. Let's get her off that ice. Yeah. Jack, look sharp. Not done yet. Don't know who's out there. Locked and ready, V. Do your thing. Yes, sir. B, need to know what's going on. Jackie Air Hypo, fuck, this is bad. Catch Chica. <sighs> All right, we is got it... you. Oh shit, it worked. We got you. Where are Chica? Get her outside. We got you. Don't you worry. We got you. Where are? Get her out, Terrace. I'm coming. Stop in the doorway? Okay, I'll stop in the doorway. Place the patient on the ground. Yes, sir. Uh, there we go. Five steps back. Now. Okay, I'm going. I'm going. Jesus, I'm going. T133 to control. Patient NC57044 secured. Stimulus being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 for venogen. Right. Let's get out of here. Elevator gets us to the garage direct. Uh oh. Good work. Shit show's over. Are you alive? Got my wires now. See you in the near future. Listen, Chica, I got this thing. Mind if I borrow your wheels? Huh. Hold up. I got a day with Misty, but I can't oh. take the metro. How's I gonna look for me? Won't leave you hanging, Jack. But don't get used to it. Alright, this thing is way too heavy for me to actually carry around, but... I just gotta try it out, dude. Oh! Hell yeah. Alright, that's all I wanted to do. <laughs> that's all I wanted. Can I go in here? Oh, hold up. She's all yours. I'm beat as it is. Wait a sec. Is this... Oh no, okay. I thought I found a secret area for a minute. I was like, wait a second, this is cool as hell. But yeah, no. I'm just grabbing random things. I don't even know what they are at this point. Alright, I'm with you, Jackie. There we go. Oh, almost forgot. Should get Wakako in the hollow. Tell her the job's done. Okay, so telephone. Let's get Wakako. <clears throat> v, how did it go? Our client is alive and well. Mm. Yeah, relatively well. Trauma team took her off our hands. She'll recover. Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you're to make it past the corridor, you must move fast. 
Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Words out the NCPD is gonna put Watson on lockdown. If I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight, we better put it in fifth. Leave it to me, Chica. I'm driving. Okay. Cool. You can drive. That works for me, bud. That works for me. Some interesting music. Okay. Okay. Can't stop digging night city. City like any other. Just bigger. Ah, Chica. Not just any other city. Morgan Blackhand. Adam Wayland. Adam Smasher. Smasher. Legends are born here. You live in your brain. City your train, city you scully in the gullies, yeah. Bully in the burrows, uh. Starving. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? Yeah. Jackie. They're locking down Watson, remember? Ah. Oh shit. Right. Draw weapon alt. Okay, interesting. Hold the weapon and return to the seat. Double tap. As the passenger drawing your weapon allows you to lean out the window and use your entire arsenal of equipped ranged weapons. I should have kept that massive gun, dude. Ah. Okay. Oh boy. Okay, this is cool. Okay, I'm gonna double tap here. Oh, that's not working. Okay, action blocked. It doesn't want me to do that right now. There we go. Uh, we're just driving on the pavement here. On the sidewalk. Can I take them out? I swear I just got the driver. I'm trying, bud. Ooh! Okay. <sighs> Scratched your baby up pretty bad. Sorry, V. It's okay. I can wait. Let's just focus on getting home. Was that just a random thing? I guess it was. Huh. Munchies. Oh, moon cheese? Is that what I said? Damn. Pulling out all the stops. Yeah. Oh, okay. Watson's on lockdown to further notice. Necessary security measures. Officer, ma'am. Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? What's it that makes me so special? A uh, heart of gold? Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh-huh. I'm gonna be worried sick if I don't show. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. She's giving me a chance. I'm waiting. <sighs> That's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe, but he's a good kid. Let them through, but they don't laugh. Wow. Okay, on your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. Okay. Didn't expect that to work, but works for me. So you can be nice. So you can be nice when you feel. When am I not nice? Um, always. I'm always never not nice. I like Jackie a lot. He's great. A good friend. Oh god, I just love the aesthetic of everything. Like the neon and... Oh. 
What? Ain't your average badges. It's Max Tack. It's PD's Apex Predators. Huh. Impact rolls in when things fly out of hand. Gunk's up there, though. Just a midday snack for him. Well, show's over. Poor bastards. But they had it coming. Damn. Okay. Note to self, don't mess with Max Tack. Riding as a passenger, you can press F to skip the ride and arrive immediately. Well, that takes some of the fun away. But let me know what you want me to do. Let me know what you want me to do. Do we skip rides? Do we just keep chatting with Jackie Maybe. and looking around? Almost at your place. What about you? Not likely to make it back to Haywood now. Kill V? They'll let me through. Sure about that? Oh yeah. I'll play nice guy. Okay. Okay, so I guess this is my apartment, which means I should be able to change my clothes and stuff, I think. Thanks. Tell Misty I said hi. I will. Ahí luego. Ahí luego. Peace out, bud. Cool. Level up. Hell yeah. Okay, let's open my perks. So, same stuff as before. We're gonna leave the body fairly low for now. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. I see, I see, I see, I see. Attribute points and perk points. So, let's see what these give us. We can... Crafting, engineering, stealth, cold blood. I don't know what cold blood is going to do. I quite like the idea of my reflexes being better. I think that that would be a good thing to do. Maneuverability, overall movement speed. Yeah, I feel like I'm going to be quite like a quite a, a zippy individual. So like, I think reflexes is a good one to is a good one to upgrade. Um, I actually need to figure out where I spend the point. Do I? Okay, yeah, there's loads of options. My god, it's so deep. <laughs> Ooh. Crit chance with pistols and revolvers. Reduces reload time. Dude, let's get that crit chance. Yes. High, it's high noon somewhere in the world. There we go. So that's my perk point that I just spent. Okay. And I have an attribute point, which I think I'm going to put into reflexes as well. There we go. Awesome. Cool. And I've got my inventory here. Look at me. I look so sick. Yes. I love it. I've got... Oh, I can put I can put clothes on and stuff here. Oh, no. No. Take it off. Take it off immediately. Unequip. Unequip. Get rid of it. Disgusting. We're selling that for sure. <laughs> Let's see what kind of tops I've got. Okay. That's that's nice. I don't, I don't mind that at all. Scav chick. Yeah, we can, we can, we can wear that for now. We've got V's favorite top, or we've got Frayed Scav Combat Shirt. Um, honestly, you know what? Let's just let's just rock it for a bit. Let's rock it. It doesn't it doesn't hurt at all. I also pretty yeah, I'm pretty sure I got some other interesting looking guns. So I do have an AR right now that I should try out. Like this revolver's got higher DPS though, so maybe that'd be better to use. Bullets can ricochet. It's got chemical damage as well. And two headshot damage multiplier. Okay, you know what? Let's try that revolver. I just buffed my, my pistol crit damage, right? So, like, we should try that revolver out for sure. Um, can I just equip another gun, though? I think I I think I can. Yeah, I can. Okay. Bless. That's fine. Beautiful. And we can put the shotty on. We can try that out. Just to see, just to see how it goes. So, we've also got our cyber deck down here. We've got... Uh, mods that we can put on. There's so much stuff to get to grips with. My goodness, this is so cool. For now, I reckon, instead of spending ages and ages in this menu, I reckon we keep it moving, and um, I'll come back to this momentarily. But I've got my weapons now, which is good. I mean, I'm, I'm literally going to my home, so it doesn't matter so much, but... Dude, that animation is was sick. That was so cool. 
Um, I need to go up the elevator. There we go. Uh, up. Apartments. Oh, we got a call. Forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Ah. Zip in your deeds. Debug has given you an important step on the path to developing your net running skills. Be sure to complete it when you get a chance. Yes! I want to net run! Yes! I'm looking forward to that for sure. Alright, go home. That's the plan. Okay. I was wondering if they were going to talk to me, but I guess they can just stand there. Bruh! Zero, oh, put some clothes on. <laughs> busted again. Third time. Paid to get it fixed the last two. Gotta be some what? kind of scam. What? What? <laughs> gonna have a word okay, then. Yeah. This is my place. Hell yeah. I made it home. I've got my wardrobe. Oh, I've got dollars in there, apparently. Yoink. Taking my own money, dude. Taking my own money. Uh, I guess I'll just take all of those as well. Because, I mean, they belong to me, so there's no reason not to, right? Just going to go and scavenge all my stuff. Bolshevik vodka. All right, we're going to use that real quick. <laughs> I'm going to take that. Uh, we'll take the cigarettes. Oh, I'm a little drunk. I'm a little woozy. I don't need to sit down. That's fine. There's my bed. Uh, I can take the bounce back. Oh, we're going to take a quick look in the mirror, it looks like. Bruh. Stop looking. Stop looking. Jesus Christ. Am I actually not wearing anything? Why did... <laughs> oh, we're not doing that. We're not We're not showering, dude. <laughs> we're not showering. <laughs> uh, I'll take... I'll ta Honestly, I'll take the whiskey. <laughs> I'll take the whiskey. Okay. Check your weapons stash. Uh, I think that's going to be here. Look at this. It's a secure system for storing equipment and can be accessed from all of your available safe houses and vehicles. If you store something in your car trunk, you'll be able to access it from your apartment. Awesome. Okay. That's really good to know. So let's open my stash. Wow. I have a black unicorn katana. That looks very nice. Uh, the knife also looks cool, but if I've got a katana, do I need it? Probably not. Um, so... I like the crop top a lot, actually. And I've got my streetwear pants. And what else have we got here? School jacket, galaxy t-shirt. Oh, that's a witcher shirt. <laughs> nice. Okay, so I've now, I guess, in my inventory, got a black unicorn blade, which is pretty sick. Let's, uh, let's leave that for now and go to bed. Okay. Sleepy time. Got the PJs on. You're going to sleep like that? Man, I'm an animal. I'm an animal. Okay. So, that is the end of the prologue and the beginning of Act 1. And what we're going to do is we're going to save the rest of Act 1 for the next episode. So, guys, let me know if there's any feedback that you've got, anything at all. Please let me know what you would like to see, what you'd like changed, what you'd like improved, or what you'd like just me to do to basically make it more enjoyable for all of you guys. Uh, this has been really fun. Really liking the game a lot. Not sure about all the nudity in terms of how that's going to do on YouTube. Like, I don't mind it personally, but obviously on YouTube... I've got to follow YouTube's rules, so not sure exactly how to navigate that one, but yeah, basically loving the game so far. If you're liking it as well and you want to see me continue this playthrough all the way to completion, then drop a like on the video, of course, as well. And yeah, I mean, just uh, happy to be here and happy that this is so fun because it is so unbelievably fun so far and the aesthetic and the vibes of the world is just just great. So yeah, thanks for being here, guys. I'll see you soon. Bye for now.